Hi, this is Ben Simon from Media Brighton TV, and this is the After Effects Spin Out Effect Tutorial. Stay tuned. So in my film Banana Pearl, which if you haven't watched it, you should watch it first, there's a link below. So in my film, I wanted to have a guy look like he's sort of having a bit of a spin out moment. And so this is how I did it. So this is the After Effects project. And if I turn all of the other elements off, you can just watch the actual source footage underneath. So basically that's, that's basically what I'm working with. Now, if I turn on the one of these layers, all it is is I've duplicated the layer and then I've, only, I've just brought the edges in. So this clip only lasts for a, a few frames. So it only lasts for this particular section. Okay, and all I've done with this particular one is I've then brought the opacity from naught up till uh, 50 odd to bring it in slowly. And I've actually got the clip at 105 percent so it's slightly bigger so you can see it doesn't quite fit the frame and it gives this jaggedy kind of look almost like a sort of bad 3d you know when you're not looking through the glasses and because you know it basically follows the movement but it just sort of adds that kind of slightly slightly something's wrong looking effect to it and then i just bring the opacity back down and then out again so sort of suddenly you're back in the room kind of feeling um, now all I've done is the next one up I've kind of done the same thing but more aggressively so I've then I then move the keyframes I sort of keyframe it a bit to have this bit of a jump there sort of jumps off his face you know I, I actually sort of zoom in more and actually move the footage uh, animated sort of over the top and that gives that jump, sort of jumpy effect and then this last one up here uh, if I just go and turn these ones off, uh, this last one here is actually an asset from the Video Copilot Riot Gear package. And if I play it without, you can see it's this kind of jaggedy TV noise effect. And essentially all I do is add a mask to it. So I sort of mask out around his face. When I put that on the add mode, it means that you just see the jaggedy thing over his face. You don't see it sort of on the background. And, you know, I'd, because it's quite a still still shot, I don't have to animate the mask that much. Um, but you can just see the sort of jaggedy kind of lines appearing over the top of his face. Now, I've brought the opacity right down, so it's pretty subtle. It's sort of, I'm bringing the opacity up and down, you know, in and out, just so you just get a hint of that. And essentially, if I turn all those on together, that's the, that's the whole the effect of the whole shot together and it gives a nice sort of spinny outy effect the barman says i've got, I've got salt and vinegar over the sort of area where where we get the little sort of jaggedy spin out sort of area i've just cut into the audio and i've added a bit of delay on there a little bit with with the feedback on 13 percent and the mix on 50 percent and a thousand seconds but basically you can just play around with the settings to see what matches and then what i did is i added the same bit of audio in underneath on the on the line below but if i go into this particular piece what i've done is i've re reversed it so you do that just by click, uh, right clicking, go to speed duration, and then click on reverse speed. Okay, and so if I play that now, you'll see the reverse effect. And I've also got delay on that. Okay, and as you can see, that we've got a delay on here, and it's a bit more aggressive, this particular delay, so it feels like it's further away says. in the background. So the two down. together um, give the a nice effect. Flavour crisps have you got? The barman says, I've got salt and vinegar. Okay, so I hope you found that helpful. Any questions, leave them in the comments below. Give us a like, a share, and subscribe to the channel. This is Ben Simon from Media Brighton TV, and you've been watching the After Effects tutorial Spin Out Effect. Thanks for watching. I have a completely free ebook for you. It's five essentials to indie filmmaking, my special tips to make a more professional production. So just click on the link below this video, enter your details, and I'll send you that completely free. Thanks for watching.